Oh man, that was quick. What did I say? True. Told you, I told you when you interviewed me and you doubted me and everybody's doubted me. I said you will see Saturday night and what that what happened. You seen? Uh, all respect to Matilda. I've got lots of respect for him. Uh, I love how respected he is in the country. Uh, every person I've spoken to has not had a bad word to say for him, uh, but that just makes this victory all that much better. Uh, I knew I was coming in as an underdog. I was one of the biggest underdogs on the card, but I believed in myself, and uh, I, I had a great team behind me that believed in me, and we knew that was going to happen. He's a great fighter, but I'm just on another level. Uh, I'm just starting to get, get show my potential. Uh, I don't want to brag, but KSW have got a great signing, and uh, I'm just going to keep getting better. Liver kicks. It was the game plan? Um, body kicks are, are, are always part of my game. Uh, I have people say, oh, what happens if they get caught? Uh, what happens if this? What happens if that? Um, I had a, I had a liver kick caught, yeah. Um, he came under me straight left twice. Uh, very nice. Uh, so every time I went straight left, he came underneath it, uh, slipped it. So I started showing that uppercut. But I, I, real, I realized early that as, as he was coming in, he, 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 he was leaving it wide. Uh, his overhand wasn't, he was slipping my shot, but he wasn't landing his shot. So I, I, knew, that, I knew I could come straight underneath that rib. Uh, the first one actually slapped across right in the middle of the solar plex. Uh, I realised he hurt him. Uh, I think I hit him with a flying knee as well. Uh, credit, credit for Matilda hanging in there. He took one more body shot and then uh, rest for history. So what next for you? Khalid off, of course. Yeah. Khalid. He's on a free fight win streak. He's uh, one of the best fighters. Uh, Matilda's on a free fight win streak. One of the best fighters in uh, Poland. Uh, former champion, and, and I've just took him out in uh, in first round. I don't, I don't know if it was faster than Kalidov, so around the same time. But I, I, I'm there in that pitch. I, I want Kalidov next. I've got again another fight. I've got respect for. He's, he's undefeated in KSW, but these are the fights I want. I, I know where I'm at, honestly, and I'm going to keep proving it. So you want to be the champ? Of course, I want to be the champ. Yeah, that's the goal. KSW, KSW uh, champion by end of year. And the show, you like it? Yeah, and I'm not just saying this, I mean, I mean this from the bottom of my heart. B production, everything, best show I've fought on by far. Uh, the fans, um, Polish fans are amazing. And again, I'm not just saying it, uh, be before uh, this fight night, best fans in the world for me were Swedish. Uh, Swedish fans love MMA, uh, and I, I, I thought they would take some topping, but Polish fans love it, and uh, the sport they've given me, uh, uh, even though I've been fighting their fighter, they've uh, been shaking my hand and things like that. So yeah, loads of respect. What do you think about Mamet's style? He probably won the fight, I guess. I think Nukun, Nukun, uh, Nukun, have I said that right? Nukun, yeah. Nukun, I think he's, I think he's won. Uh, who knows? Uh, who won? Who won? Well, Nakun so won. Submit Mamet, Nakun, wow. Yeah. Damn it. He's still the middleweight champ, so looks like he's taking two losses in a row. Well, Scott, congrats. Thank you very much. And uh, just, just I'm going to see you on the next show. Thank, Thank you, you very much. You'll see me soon. Thank you to the fans. Thank you so much. Thank you.